The recently discovered OpenSSL vulnerability known as Heartbleed Bug is believed to impact nearly 50% of the world's websites. The bug enables attackers the ability to perform man-in-the-middle attacks on any of the impacted websites. It works by taking advantage of the Heartbeat extension in TLS that is designed to keep TLS sessions open even if no data is being transmitted between the client and the server. Normally, a TLS Heartbeat request includes the payload and its size, to which the responding server replies with a heartbeat that includes a payload of the same size. The heart bleed bug consists of the attacker sending a heartbeat request that includes, for example, a one byte payload, but lists the payload size as being 64 kilobytes. However, when OpenSSL copies the payload into memory, instead of validating that the actual size of the payload received was one byte, The heartbeat code in OpenSSL trusts the value of the heartbeat size as defined, which is 64 kilobytes. In order to return a heartbeat of the same size, the OpenSSL heartbeat function copies sensitive information stored in memory to fill up the 64 kilobyte file. This information includes the private keys from X509 certificates and usernames and passwords, which is then returned back to the attacker. Unfortunately, because the exploitation of the bug leaves no trace, there's no way to identify if your organization has been a victim of this bug. For this reason, the following recommended actions should be performed on all impacted servers. Update to OpenSSL 1.0.1G. Revoke certificates in use on those impacted servers. Issue new certificates for newly created keys. Install and verify that the new keys and certificates are being used on those systems. And change usernames and passwords. Cybercriminals continue to attack the trust that every organization has in keys and certificates. Failure to rapidly remediate the heartbleed bug will result in sensitive customer information and credentials being stolen.